Hello everybody, I'm your host, Halo Three Amateur, and welcome to my new Let's Play. In a world covered by endless water, people are forced to eke out a living on the small patches of land that remain above the sea. The people of this world rely on ancient technology driven by quantum refractors, a powerful energy source. These refractors lie in ancient ruins underground and in the sea and are sought out by explorers called diggers. These brave explorers are the sole source of refractor energy which has become a cornerstone of the emerging civilization. Originally, this was the diggers' only purpose, to find refractors so that civilization might endure. However, over the years, the story of a fabulous treasure, the legendary Mother Lode, began to be whispered among the diggers. The Mother Lode, a treasure so great that if it were discovered, it would provide so much power that the world never need fear running out of energy. Seeking this Mother Lode, diggers travel from one island to another in their flying machines, ever hoping that they'll find what they seek just over the horizon. Hope. Despair. Charity. Greed. Duty. Power. Who can say what truly motivates the diggers? That's right, you guys, we're playing Mega Man 64, or Legends if you prefer, but, uh, anywho, I'm going to explain a few things, uh, after the cutscene, after I hit new game here. Uh, I'm going to set up my options just real quick, just to see, you know, what there is to change, but, anywho, uh, let's get started. Mega Man? Mega Man? Mega Man? Can you hear me? Just barely. The transmission is too clear. I got worried because the transmission got cut off suddenly. I'm okay. I think this is the last door. Like Mega Man barely got out with his life right there. Anyway, dang it, roll. Uh, yeah, the Reaver bots are in the wall. I see them. There's three of them. Anywho, uh, as I was saying, this game is also known as Mega Man Legends for the PlayStation One. Uh, I'm not sure if there's any differences between this hey, game right and, you know, Legends. But, you know, there could be like a cutscene or a, a few things different about it. But, if any hey, of you guys know, man, 
please way. tell me. I don't like the way uh, anywho, you head back. uh, rolls right. I'm gonna show you guys something. Uh, you see that button at the end of the hallway there? Uh, yeah, that room's a trap. There's really nothing in there. Just six you enemies to fight. That's it. That's we'll be seeing the enemies I'm talking about later. It's not far from your current position. Yeah, a door is like to my left. I'm trying to go to it. Open doors and check things in this game. You have to push down C. Um, that, since I have, right in front of you. it's not in front of me. It's to my right. Roll, okay. Get your facts straight. <laughs> but anywho, um, yeah, to interact with things in this game, you push down C. Open doors, open chests, check openings in walls that could have something in them, that's why I'm doing it. Uh, I don't believe any of... Oh, gosh. I don't believe any of these walls have items inside them. Uh, and those items I've been picking up from enemies, uh, I'll get to explain to that in, in just a moment. Roll's about to interrupt us again. Yeah, that was three like Reaver bots just it. now. Those three small ones that we like fought in the beginning, you know? We were lucky. Yeah. Anywho, this uh, this game moves slow at this intro stage here, but after the intro stage, oh man, it's crazy. It's, I, I just love this game. It's, it's not my favorite Mega Man game of all time, but damn. <laughs> it's good. Anyway, these items. Yep, explanation. Quantum refractors are large crystals that are actually used as currency. Uh, and it said the, something about the orange squares. The orange squares right there are uh, health. Your health items in this game. Uh, just check the walls again. Um, it's been a while since I've played this game. I can't remember if there's uh, things Wait, in I these walls or not. He's above you. Watch out. Yeah, and this one's a little tricky. If you hold in Z and R, though, you should be able to lock on to the enemy above you. See, I'll let you read it right there. And uh, it should be easier to shoot them, really. Um... This is actually take two of this recording because the first time I recorded this, the uh, sound went haywire. I don't know what the hell happened, but the sound just started distorting itself and you couldn't hear anybody say anything or anything. You just hear the sound effects super distorted and everything and that roll I just did will help you in future events trust me uh, in this room there's only two treasure chests and if you open the room well this one's got a power razor basically it will well yeah here's the explanation explanation right here attach to attach it to any of your buster parts and uh, yeah. Here, I'll just go ahead and show you. Power Razor gives me plus one attack, which actually doubled my attack, so I only had one attack, I guess. I guess that's how it works. Anywho, 560 Zinni. Zinni is your currency in this game. Yeah, so you can rather find them in the chest, or you can uh, kill enemies to get it. Oh boy, not good. Wolf, are you all right? And yes, Mega hear? Man talks in this game. Mega Man actually has a voice, and it actually sounds pretty good. Um, unlike Tron Bond, the Misadventures of Tron Bond, uh, this is going to be a single player, or not single player, but the Seagull commentary video, but, uh, I'm about to beat the floor. Yeah.
Look at that guy. Well, I have to have to say it after being underground for so long. Hmm. I wonder where Roar went. Nice timing roll. Anytime, Mega Man. I'm sorry, Mega Man. I had some engine problems, and... It's okay, Roll. But I'm glad you showed up when you did. All's well that ends well, right? And we were able to get a refractor. We should be able to get by with that for a while. If only the mother load were as easy to find as this. Don't worry. We'll find it someday. And your parents, too. Thanks. I know we will. Oh, the engine's overheating. The smoke's so thick I can barely see. What? I guess the flutter's in worse shape than I thought. Oh, this is for five feet or she's going crazy. She can't take much more of this. Ramp, can you open up the number 11 valve again? Got it. We'd better find some place to sit down. Mega Man, check the map. There's an island called Cadillac about 100 miles southwest. looks pretty bad. I don't think it'll be safe to set foot in here for quite a while. We've been pushing her so hard. Haven't been taking good enough care of her. We'll just have to fix her up. Looks like the repairs aren't going to be finished anytime soon. We'll be here for a while, I guess. This island, what you call it, Mega Man? Cattle lock? Must have a town or a city somewhere. Think you could go take a look around? Yeah, sure, I'll go take a look around. Why not? Anywho, this guy is a little monkey friend named Data. Alright. We already knew that, didn't you? We've been friends for years. We have. Uh, does anyone remember Mega Man having a little monkey friend? I mean, what? <laughs> Oh wow, oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys, this game, uh, I bought it 
pre-owned. So, yeah, it's already got quite a bit of data on it, actually. Uh, whenever I opened it, it basically had, uh, well, it, it's in, it was in pretty good condition when I bought it, so no box or anything, but I got it from G2K, yeah. Anyway, I saved over all three of the files, because we're probably going to need them or something, I don't know. Anywho, uh, back to the boss fight that we just did after all those cut, after all that cutscene. Uh, all you have to do for that boss is just keep holding in the R button and the B button and running rather well, running right, or you can hold in Z and run left. So hold in R, right, or left. Oh, okay, hold in R, Z right left and B but other than that uh, yeah it's, it's pretty simple boss my strategy is just hold in R B and hold right and you'll just run into a circle so yeah anyway folks this has been Halo 3 Amateur and I will see you guys next time for more Mega Man 64 as I look at the, at the forest in front of me. See you guys later.